I'm joined here by John Merriman, who's director of this fantastic studio. Thank you so much for letting me in this morning. I mean, what are your hopes for the spring statement? We've got Rishi Sunak making an announcement later this afternoon. As someone who owns a small business, what are you hoping for from it? I'm really hoping for some stability with this. Everything's changing at the moment for small businesses. We have a coffee shop at the front called Metronome and the studio at the back. Both businesses are affected by whichever way his decisions go today. So the minimum wage hike is a, is a huge thing. We know that's coming anyway, so we're preparing for that. But with around 500 hours of staff time on a, per month on a small business, a pound more per hour is a, a huge hike there. So we, we're preparing for that. But any surprises are going to really hit small businesses hard this morning. Now, of course, we've been talking a lot on GB News about the cost of living and, of course, particularly sort of fuel increases. And, and we are, a lot of people are hoping Rishi Sunak is going to be making some sort of announcement, perhaps um, a fuel duty relief in that regard. I mean, as somebody who you're running a coffee shop as well as this, this business here with a recording studio, I mean, how has the, the fuel increases in price that we've seen, how has that impacted your business? It is the, it's the entire chain all the way down. So, for example, milk prices went up in December by 20% and then in February a further 20%, all put down to delivery drivers and the cost of getting the food to, for example, the cows. That was one of the biggest costs at the beginning, a lot of that coming from Europe. So the costs right right from the, the source ingredients through to just general uh, minimum orders now are, they used to be around 50, 60, 70 pounds for a minimum order in the coffee shop. Now they're heading towards 100, 200 pounds for minimum minimum orders. So that means the smaller um, businesses are going to struggle more. So without some support with the fuel costs, then small businesses will keep being hit hard by this.